Total numbers have climbed to 37,336. Stands at 39,980. Reached 40,000 when it comes. Jumped to 42,533. 46,000 plus cases. Confirmed cases is now inching towards the 50,000 mark. With India is at 84,712 cases. This is a crazy time. Schools and colleges have been closed since mid-March and nobody exactly knows when they're gonna open. A lot of them have started online classes. People can't go outside without a mask and they're made to stand six feet apart from one another. People are stacking food at once because they're scared to go out. Every store is closed except the ones that sell essentials and even these are open for a limited time. Park, benches and walk-in places are no more accessible to the public. Every sort of sporting event, competitions, festivals and entertainment events have been banned or cancelled. Hugs and handshakes are not a thing anymore. Places of worship are closed. Well, kind of. Our Prime Minister is making us do some weird stuff. April 5th, it's 8.57. Lights about to go down at around 9. I can hear firecrackers. So it's 9 p.m. April 5th. Hospitals are closing down when we need more. We have fewer ventilators than we need. Toilet paper, hand sanitizers, masks are in short supply and limited per person. Almost all countries have closed their borders. Even some states within countries have closed their borders. Every city has been divided into tiny zones and an instant fine is issued for crossing the zone without a valid reason. Sanitizer thing will go through it, it just it cleans your whole body. We are stuck in our houses and I'm spending a lot of time with my family and myself, waiting, like everyone else, for things to go back to normal. I'm making this video because we probably will never experience this again. I hope we don't have to. And when all of this is over, I can come back to this video and remind myself that life is precious and nothing should be taken for granted.